Hey guys, welcome to another vlog. So today is, I think it's Tuesday and I got some work to do today, but I also have some errands and shopping I wanna do. It is going to be my official cleaning day, or I guess more so my laundry day. I need to change my bed sheets, clean my laundry. I also wanna reorganize my closet because I've been getting a lot of spring and summer clothes and I need to do another closet clean out. I literally have to do one of these like maybe once every couple months because it just keeps getting clothes and it just never ends. So today's gonna be a little clean with me, shop with me, day in my life. I didn't really sleep well last night. I feel like my bottom of my left eye is like kind of swollen. Does anyone ever get that? Like when you don't really sleep well or when you're like super, super tired and sleepy still, like you, the bottom of your eye like just feels like kind of sore, like puffy. Like it's not a sty, but like just feels like swollen anyway maybe that's tmi i apologize we're gonna go drink our coffee and then i'm gonna clean first because i want to just get it over with before i go do my errand it is a beautiful beautiful day i'll take you guys on the balcony i never go on the balcony at least never in the vlog and oh we had a little photo shoot on the balcony yesterday so i had to move some things around now that it's like warmer weather we're definitely going to be out here a lot more okay this goes here this goes on my table my little lanterns go in the corner so yeah here's my little balcony if you've never seen it before although i've shown it in my apartment tour but yeah it's a beautiful morning and i'm so happy the little forest um that's by the apartment is like fully bloomed like all the trees have leaves again it's just so nice to look at and the patio set is from Joss Maine. Okay, I'm going to drink my coffee. I need energy. I'm really tired. The show must go on. So, wanted to say shout out to Poshmark for sponsoring this video. Like I said, you guys know I am very active on Poshmark. I am always listing my clothes on there and I'm always like engaging on there and talking about how I like to make a little bit of extra money on the side by selling all of my old clothes on Poshmark. It's a great way to literally clear up your closet and get rid of things you don't want anymore. And there's also a lot of different things you can buy on there. I actually like to like take the earnings that I earned from Poshmark and put it towards other things that I like to buy on Poshmark They have a lot of accessories a lot of like shoes clothes hats like literally everything they have on Poshmark So it's a really great way to like get rid of things You don't want get rid of your cluttered closet and also make a little bit of cash definitely go check out my closet I'm gonna link it in the description and also I have a link for you to create your own closet It's also really easy to do they also provide shipping labels for when you sell some Thing. like you don't have to go through the trouble of like buying a label and and all that stuff you just have to like print it out and it's so easy to do they literally email you the printing label you just print it out put it on a box and their packages are shipped via the USPS and you can get these boxes for free at the post office I always like to tell people that because I totally had no idea until like a couple years ago but yeah you can get unlimited amount of these boxes they have like the um, mailing ones like this I usually use this for like the clothing articles because usually someone will just buy like one t-shirt and it's a really small so I'll just put it like in this one and then they have bigger ones for like shoes or purses or other stuff like that so yeah you can get these delivered right to your front door zero dollars you can just place your order on the USPS website so here is my closet in my office it's a little bit messy but this is where I store all of the clothes that I have listed on Poshmark so I actually have I think three items that I need to ship out today and we're gonna package those up and drop those off at the post office before I go run all my errands.
so this is what I mean by I need to clean out my closet. I have a pile here of clothes that I like I'm not sure if I want to keep it or not so I think I'm just gonna end up giving some of these clothes away. Oh yeah and then I got these hangers that I showed in my I think it was my Amazon favorites video my most recent one and someone asked me to like show how it works so I'll show that later but yeah we need to clean out my closet and I'm going to list some of these things on Poshmark. Okay, so cleaned out my closet again, and we got even more clothes in the Poshmark closet that I just listed. So go check out my closet, link in the description to shop all of these clothes. I got some body suits, we got some beach cover-ups, we got some button-down shirts, we got this long, oh my gosh, I actually really love this romper, but... I've just worn it so many times that I just don't feel like I would ever wear it again, but it is gorgeous. So go check out my closet. Closet is once again all cleaned out of the clothes that I no longer want. And I finally, finally cleaned that pile of clothes that was there for a super long time. And I ended up having a lot of extra space on the little pants rack. I didn't even like use this whole one. I did get rid of a couple pairs of jeans, but I actually have a lot more pairs of jeans in my office, like glam room. And I have more that I ordered on the way, so I think it's fine. But in case you're wondering how this little pants rack worked, so you can like have it straight up like that, and that's how you can arrange all the pants on it as you please. You can leave it like that, or to save space, you can take the one side off, just put it down like that, and then it lays or it hangs flat like that. So I love it. I think it'll be nice, and I'm glad I have like more room for the more jeans and pants that I am bound to buy soon. I just got this package in the mail. I'm so excited because I already know what this is. This is a company aesthetic by Nisha and I believe she's one of my subscribers or uh, one of my viewers. She reached out to me and she makes candles and a discount code for you guys. Step 10, you can get 10% off. These are her socials on Instagram, aesthetic by Nisha. These are actually a lot bigger than I expected. I thought they were going to be like half the size, but these are really good sizes. This one is called Sundays. This is citrus and vanilla. And this one is called Aesthetic. This is Lavender Sage Clean Cotton. They're both 13 ounces. Oh my God, and it smells so good and I love the wick. I love candles with the wick like this. These candles are so cute. Thank you so much for sending these. And again, go check her store out. It'll be linked in my description. Today's OOTD, I feel like it's literally nothing different. I feel like I wear the same thing like every day. Leggings, tall socks. My new balances and some combination of a t-shirt or sweater. I love this hoodie though. It's from Zara and it's so, so soft. I got it like last year. I don't know if they still sell it, but it's like my essential go-to like pullover sweater. So we're going to head out now. It looks like it's going to rain. I don't know where this came from. It was like sunny earlier today. So I'm going to like get a move on because I feel like it's going to like pour on me again. I look like I'm ready to go like paint graffiti on the school wall, but it started raining of course 
So we got my little hood up. But anyway, I just dropped off some packages at the post office, my Poshmark packages. And now I'm going to go to H&M, Ulta. Those are the two stores I need to go to. And I think I also want to stop by Uniglo. And I don't know how like well known that store is because I don't really see a lot of people talking about it. They're known for like their essentials. So like button downs, t-shirts, like really good quality, basic essentials like that. So I wanted to go check some stuff out. I'll take you guys along with me, vlog as much as I can. So Uniqlo is there. H&M's here, but I want to go to Uniqlo first because I feel like I'll find better like essentials there. guys every time I go shopping I always have to use the bathroom so I hope Ulta has a bathroom also the weather is just playing games today it's literally raining right now I don't know if you can see it's sprinkling and it's sunny as hell so who knows what's going on there we go I think we'll just try the two small ones for now came home to a Fun package from Coda Wines. This is a brand new line of sparkling wines. These are Proseccos inspired by Italy. It's a product of Italy and this is direct to consumers so you can order it online. They bring it or deliver it to your house. So we're gonna try this later. It looks really good. I do have a code. It's X Stephanie Rose 15 off if you want to get some money off and try this out. But yeah, I'll try that later and let you guys know how it is. Okay, kids, let's do a haul. So Ulta, I didn't get much because I really didn't need anything. I have so much skincare and makeup already. But I got what I went there for, and that was for the Joico Blue Shampoo. So I got the shampoo and the conditioner. And this is for if you have like orange tones in your hair, it helps eliminate the brassy orange tones. Whereas I usually use purple shampoo and that helps eliminate brass also, but I think that's more focused on like yellow tones. I feel like my hair this time around is a little bit more orangey than yellow. So I do have purple shampoo, but I wanted to try this out. My friend actually recommended this and her hair looked great. So I wanted to try this out. I'm gonna use this tonight along with my Christoph Robin variation mask, I think it's called. It's the purple one. So I'll start with Uniglow first. I think that was my second time ever going into Uniglow. I normally I don't shop there because I was ever a fan of like the super basic essentials but now that's exactly my style like all I wear is like basics and you know like just bare minimal essentials and I kind of like am building my wardrobe up in terms of like adding more basic staples to my wardrobe so um, if you like that type of style Uniglow is perfect and they do have an online store so if you don't have a location near you you can just order online but yeah I got a lot of stuff and I will do a try on haul of everything that I show I'll do that probably after I'm gonna just show everything first and then like I'll try it on later so um, okay the first things I got are this set so I got a bike short and kind of like sports bra set this is super strong material like super thick at the waistband and this is how short there they're pretty short but i thought i could use this for working out in the summer and this is a size large it was 24.90 25 dollars and then i got the matching top this is a sports bra top it has a built-in built-in bra super padded and i got this in a medium this is also 25 dollars and they had a lot of really cute colors as you guys saw i think i vlogged some of that and i think this would be cute in the summer as like a nice casual outfit too the next thing i got are these jogger pants i was so intrigued by this i really 
liked the tassel of of the drawstring i don't know why but this reminded me of like uh, breakfast at tiffany's because you know how she had the the what do you call those the ear phone ear blockers ear cancellation noise oh, god um ear plugs that's the word i'm looking for they are cinched at the bottom i love them i think they're so elegant i thought they were cute they're only 20 dollars, so hopefully they fit good and then i got all essential tops i got this white t-shirt super basic but it's like your essential white tee it's a little bit oversized i got a size medium oh and the pants got a size large it's just like kind of boxy it's just your standard oversized tee this was 15 dollars a good price for like a nice tee and the quality is seriously so amazing and this is the next top i got it's a long sleeve pastel yellow pale yellow banana whatever color you want to call it it's just a button-up shirt and again guys material but yeah this was on clearance this was originally i think 30 dollars. the tag says 14.90 but i think on the receipt it's actually 9.90 so i got this for 10 dollars. so i thought this would be a cute brunch shirt i could tuck this into jeans last thing i got is this ribbed top it is a kind of nude color beige i love 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 the color and i love the texture of it the ribbed look of it such a nice essential that I could wear under blazers. So that's all I got from Uniglo. I'll try those on later. I'll show you guys what I got from H&M now. I went into H&M with the purpose of finding clothes, like beachy clothes for my vacation coming up and I didn't succeed. I just bought random clothes that, I don't know, I thought would be cute for the summer still. So I got a pair of jeans and I have a love-hate relationship with H&M's jeans because I'm a curvy girl and I feel like they don't make jeans that cater to girls that are bigger on the bottom and smaller in the waist. So, um, I don't know. I hope these will be good. These are the high-waist, wide-leg jeans. It's just a plain pair of jeans. There's, like, no nothing crazy about it. I'm usually size 8. I always have to size up in jeans in general, but H&M jeans tend to run small for me. So maybe I should have gotten a 12, but we'll see. We'll see how that works out. And then I got a pair of these shorts. They're like a twill black short. These are only $13. And these are a size 8. It's like a nice summer essential to wear with any kind of top. And I did get this linen top I thought that would be cute for the beach. It's a natural linen material, short sleeve. Like, look how beachy that is. I feel like I can wear this, like, opened with a pair of shorts and, like, my bikini top underneath for, like, a beach look. So it's pretty pricey, though. It was $24, but I think for the material, it's it's worth it. The next thing I got is a, another pair of shorts. And, again, I thought this would be a nice essential for the summer. It's kind of like a cream uh, eggshell white color. The quality is amazing. Again, I feel like I could wear this with a lot in the summer. Next, I got this t-shirt that I just thought was so cute. It says NASA on the front and on the back. It says NASA again and planet earth we gotta help planet earth i love the color of it i just thought the design was so cute so i really love oversized t-shirts for the summer i kind of just like live in them and i wear them like on the daily with like leggings and sneakers and that's like my kind of like grocery store errands outfit so that's all that i got so i'm gonna go ahead and try these on now and i'll show you guys what everything looks like first thing we're trying on is the t-shirt and i love it it's just so comfortable so there's that it's a size large here is that beige or nude shirt from uniglo absolutely love it fits so good quality feels so nice and then here are the black shorts from h&m they fit but they feel weird and awkward so i'm not sure how i feel about them it like doesn't fit in the right places like h&m pants i just don't think were made for curvy girls here are the other shorts from h&m i really like these these fit so much better these are the same size as the black ones but these just fit so much more better so yeah, I love that. And then here is the linen top from H&M. I think this is okay. I feel like it's a little bit too safari. I'm not sure. I think it looks good with these shorts, but maybe I have to wear them with jeans. But yeah. I threw the blazer over that outfit, and I love the blazer. The lighting is kind of off. Yeah, there we go. I feel like the blazer is the exact same color as the shorts. So that would be a cute outfit, but I probably wouldn't wear that shirt underneath. So yeah. Ooh, I love that. Yeah, I love the blazer. Here are the shorts, and sports bra set it is so comfortable oh my god i love the material it's so soft everything fits so nicely 
yeah this is a really good material set definitely worth the price oh my god i am seriously obsessed with the uniqlo satin pants <gasps> they fit so good i love how i got a size large and it actually fits like a size large like it has extra room it's baggy the color is so nice i'm so obsessed with the color and the way it fits i need to go back and get more i need to get more of these because these are so comfortable like i can like move around in them and you can wear them like out you can wear them in they said that you can either wear this like as loungewear or um like going out but oh my god i'm so obsessed with these here's the t-shirt from uniqlo i'm gonna just take this off because i have no intentions on returning it the quality you guys is i literally can't even begin to like tell you how obsessed i am with the quality and the fitting of the uniglo clothes yeah so this is a size medium and it's pretty good here's the button up cream shirt as they call it but i still think it looks yellow i like unbuttoned all the buttons like kind of made this like shoulder shirt off the shoulder shirt and i'm so obsessed i love it i think it looks so cute with these pants and then i also just put on these like sandals that i had from Simmy shimmy shoes. I think it's simmy shoes is how you pronounce it. So cute. I love this outfit. I feel like it's such a good, a cute summer, like beachy outfit. So maybe this will be good for the beach. I think I at least got one outfit for the beach. So yeah, I am obsessed. Love it. While we wait for my hair, I want to try the Prosecco. And I feel like it's a good time. It's like 8.30, almost 9 o'clock. So it's, it's about that time. We're going to try it and see how it tastes. Please don't spill. Please don't spill. Ah! I'm guessing it was spilling because it was like in a package getting thrown around all day. So it's probably just like all bubbled up. Okay, that is good for now. And we're gonna set the mood with my new candle. It already smells good without even lighting it. Like that's how strong and good the smell is. All right, cheers guys. Ooh, mm. it has a good flavor. Like it's not like, it's not flat like a lot of the Proseccos I try are. Like, it's really good. I like it. All right, you guys, I'm going to call it a night and end the vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. And thanks so much for watching. I'll see you guys in my next one.